Okay, YouTube, welcome back to the Heavenbound Farm, and we got a little bit of snow today. Got a little bit more than I thought we'd get anyway, and we're going to be doing our calf feeding video today. It's like all the pigs are fighting over a place to lay down. As you can see there, they're a little cranky, gets cold. Pretty sure all the goats and the ponies are all piled up up, up there in the barn. So let's walk up that way and we'll see. It's definitely a little nippy today. There's the horses we're going there and say hi to those here in a minute as well. Alright, come on, let's go for the barn. This here is Squanto, you have seen him in previous videos. Thinks he's worth a million bucks. This here is Gabriel. And man, oh man, is it all nippy. This is Gabriel. There's the calf. That's your and her baby. And let me get the calf over here with Victoria. And I will be right back here in a minute. Okay, we're about to put the calf over with his mommy. So here it goes. Hey, okay, he's free. Come on. He's gonna be stubborn today. Come on. He'll figure it out. Maybe. Well, there goes the pony chasing him. Pony's telling him to get out too. Now he's gonna come out scared of the pony. And there he goes. Okay, I got her feet and stuff for her. Got her head in the way, so some of it did go on the ground, but the majority of it is in her feeder. And he is now eating. So he's about two and a half months. Or just now. I don't know if he's two and a half months or three months. Yeah, I don't really know. I think you can track. So he's been doing pretty good so far. But anyways, guys, it has been snowing a lot out here. Like a lot, lot, so. It's cold. I can barely feel my fingers to hold on to this camera. I decided to make a video anyway. That way you guys can have some more content to look at. And yeah, he's... You can see he's pretty thirsty. Anyways, guys, he's a beautiful little calf. Oh boy. I don't know what we're going to name him yet, but if you guys have any suggestions for his name, just leave it down in the comments below. So, if we can get a name for us, guys. We ain't named him yet. We're going to leave it up to you guys to decide our subscribers, our supporters. So, if you have a name for this little guy, just leave it down in the comments below and. We'll pick the best one, or if there's just one, we'll pick it. So, if you guys would. Now, she does kick around a little bit still. I don't know if it's just because it still hurts her, or if she just gets excited what she does, but she ain't ever really hurt him yet. So, that's good. This chicken's up here looking like awesome food. Just keeps looking out that way with feet, I suppose. Like, I want to go down, but there's a goat down there. The goat poking her head there, eating it. He said, and I'll take it. She ain't gonna take it, so I'll take it. But, I'll right, get our calf feeding video for today. I ain't had one in a couple of weeks or so. Well, it definitely snowed out here. I mean, it snowed good too. It's the best snow I've seen so far this year of 2020. Uh, probably about an inch or two, maybe at most. Definitely not three or four, it's probably about an inch or two. But, 
It's it definitely snowed. It's cold too. We'll give everybody some hay too. I might put that in the video as well. Give Miss Victoria Rose a square bell of hay. As you can see, here comes the ducks and everything else running. See the ducks and stuff coming up to the barn like food. There's DJ. Look, pigs and ducks and everything else coming up to the barn. So, yeah, it's all good. We'll let him eat a little bit. We'll get him out here. But he's done good so far. He, he's been eating sweet feed as well. And hay. He drinks water sometimes, but not very often. So he's been eating. So that's pretty good. Oh, Victoria. And he has some more hay. There's the pigs and goats and stuff walking this way. Yeah, I want to feed all those as well here in a minute. But next I'm going to show you all, show you guys how all the baby goats are doing after the calf is done feeding. Now I'll get a video of me feeding the ponies and stuff and that will be about the end of the video. Oh, you're getting all excited. He got a black spot on the other side of his face, just like his mommy. It's about 10 30 in the morning, I think. I don't know. It's probably later than that. I can't really remember. <laughs> That's when I came out here. It's still daylight, surprisingly. So I'm probably going to put the calf back over in his pen here in just a minute, but let me eat a little bit more first. Hey, chickens and goats found the feed that I spilled. They're having a field day with it. The chicken up there, hey, that's what they want from this one go down there though. I don't know why. I wish they him and go eat now though. Hmm, a pig trying to get in here as well. So, that's nice. But, I don't know, she shoves her feeder all over the place just to get the last little bit of food.
Well, I'm gonna get him out of here, put him in his pen, and I'll introduce you guys to all the goats. See you here in a minute. Okay, guys, I'm back. I got the calf back in his pen. So now I'm gonna be introducing you all to all the goats. And this here is Droopy, and I'm a Snowflake. So that one there's Droopy, and this one here is Snowflake. They are um, uh, two females, and we had them our uh, last year's babies, but they have to be two years old before they can have babies, so we're going away by now. You're going to turn them loose probably this spring or maybe the summer. I don't know yet. But this is Droopy and Snowflake. I gave them all a little bit of hay, so let's go on to the next goat. So we'll walk over here, and we'll introduce you to... Well, we already introduced you to him before if you watch our other videos. I'm just talking about him again. This is Sherry and her baby and my Susie Q. Now, if you're wondering why our face is crooked, it's not because they're um, uh, crossbred, inbred, we want to call them. They were full blooded. They're not they weren't related at all. I think they might push up against each other during birth or something. But her face is a little on the crooked side. Most people have put them down, but we didn't. As you can see, she does good. She had her baby. She had a baby. It's the first baby she's ever had, so she's doing pretty good. Let's see if I can get her to turn around so I can see her face a little bit. Eh, she's too busy eating. Hey, see, I don't slow her down for eating either. She can still eat really good. You can kind of see it there. But next up is I'm a jelly bean and her baby dancer. Now this is Jelly Bean and Dancer. Now Dancer, we call him Dancer because, well, when he's got the energy, he's, he's bouncing all over the place like a little jumping bean. So that here is Jelly Bean and her baby Dancer. And he's really good with people. He's too busy eating hay. He said, I'm eating right now. Don't mess with me. I'm fat on him a little bit. <laughs> he said, nope, I'm eating. He said, you're not going to bother me while I'm eating. Next up is Shadell and her baby, Baby. So this is Shadell and her baby, Baby. We also, these are all this, well, not this year's, they're 2019 babies. But they're still young, they're not a year old yet. They're probably about three to, about three months old, I'd say. So they're all doing really good. So next up is this goat. He's also a last year baby. He is born about the same same time the other two was born. His name is Bucky. Now he's little for his age, what you'd think he'd be, but I don't know. He's a beautiful little male goat. We're going to use him for a breeder. Yep, probably use him for a braider, beautiful as he is. Something's gonna come to me. She said, I'm eating hay too. The last up is Lynn and her baby, I'm a cutie pie. That's Lynn and her baby, cutie pie. Now, when she had her first round of babies, for some reason, one of her nipples. Swelled up with blood and it rotted off. So it's kind of good she only had one baby instead of two, but she could have had two and just drank one at a time. But I don't know what, what caused that. But she still does pretty good with her babies. And next, I'm going to get the feed ready and we're going to feed all the animals outside. So stay tuned. Okay, now we're about to feed the horses, the goats, and the pigs, and there's what they get to get too. Five gallon buckets of sweet feed and oats mixture. So yeah, I'm about to feed those and get a video of that, so stay tuned.